How has the relationship between your two characters changed since the first film? Well, and I think when you find, you know, the Avengers this time around, we are, we are, we are this is a well-oiled machine and the introductions are over and we're now kind of working as a family, albeit a dysfunctional family, but it's it's working for us. So already that, you know, just this past Pass, passing of time has kind of allowed us all to fall into line and find our, our places and our dynamic is kind of, is a comfortable one. And were you surprised when you read the romantic elements in the script or did you know that was gonna be on the cards? I wasn't very surprised, but um, I think some of my compatriots might have been a little surprised. What are you it? talking about? <laughs> did I, you, did I, you see it coming from a mile away? No, of course not. <laughs> I came to work and I, was, I said to Joss, I was like, is this just convenient because there were no other characters left? There was like, no What's one going left. on? Yeah, uh, and of course Joss was like, they have to be together. It's Beauty and the Beast. <laughs> Which I actually think it even goes deeper than Beauty and the Beast um, because they do share this kind of, uh, ex they have, have this shared experience being two people that kind of are reluctantly there yeah. um, and they are kind of m monstrous or they feel monstrous in their own way. Hey, big guy. <laughs> Sun's getting real low. Why do you think audiences like superhero films so much? I think it's a modern mythology. I think they can easily enter into the fantasy of it. And it, it hits all the different groups for some reason. It's, uh, we've been doing this for a long time, probably starting on, on cave walls next to a, uh, a fire um, with uh, mastodons. I think that's, that's where this, uh, this sort of started. And um, wow, you're and giving us like the anthropology. And it's superhero. yeah, it's a, it's a sociological. Yeah, yeah, interesting. Anthropogenic, yes. So um, I I see it as I see it as you must have had a really high SAT score. I did actually, and in, in only in English though. My maths was abysmal. Oh, and or if you, you could have any superpower, abysmal. what would it be and why? Uh, the I. What would yours be? Um, I've always wondered that. If I could have any power. You mean one Super that would be power. really helpful for yeah. me or other people? Because, see, one that would be I really think. helpful for me is very different than one that would be helpful for other people. Like, if I could, like, like make dirty water clean water, that would be a great, That's superpower. a great superpower. But if it were just for me, I would like to teleport. Filter woman. Filter woman. <laughs> yes. Carbon lady. Yes, carbon lady. Um, but I, carbon but, neutral lady. <laughs> but I would like to be, you're such a dork. <laughs> yeah. I love you. <laughs> and so charming. Um, but I, but I would, uh, for me, I'd like to be able to teleport because then I wouldn't have to, you know. Get in a plane. Get in a plane and worry about like the TSA situation. <laughs> yes, and I, customs. I've heard you have a really hard time with the TSA. I, how do you know that? I just heard it. I, so someone said while we were traveling that you were just like, that's it, Marcel, never again. <laughs> <laughs> and Mark, what would yours be? Um, mine would probably be, uh, it'd be fun to be able to be invisible, but also to be... How I'd creepy. Li I'd like to be... <laughs> Why? I'm, I'm always trying to be invisible. What would you do invisible. with that? I would just disappear for a little while. You, what? You mean disappear like in a crowded room? Or kind of. like That's just strange. Because I like to check out the world. By, uh, and be alone. And watch, yeah. Not be alone. I like to be with people. But so. you would be alone if you were. I mean, or no, I guess people would know. So you would just have friends. I'd be knew friends, you were... <laughs> like, oh, he's he just disappeared. But I, I like the idea of um, also tele teleporting. Yeah, because it's so convenient. Yeah. You know what I mean? If you have like forty extra minutes on set or whatever, and you just, just want to like, cap back some rays. for a few moments. Yeah, or, yeah, yeah, right. I went on a I vacation, but family. you went home. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was like, oh, you know, just sit on a beach, have a margarita. <laughs>